Hello and welcomes, this is Anfwolf, and this is Dragon Age Origins, part 30 I believe. We have recently just um, solved, and, solved and helped out the Circle of Magi, and we have an emissary sent from them for as a go-between basically between the Templars and the Circle of Magi basically, yes. And now we are here. Try and decide where to go next. I think I said we were going to go to Denrim and Redcliffe and just check to see if anything's new, see if we can turn in any quests. We might actually be able to go to the Denrim alienage now, which is something we have yet to be able to do because they were having um, issues there last time. So, it might be worth having a check out. But in the meanwhile, we have um, plenty of people we can talk to here in the camp. So let's what people let's see what people have to say. Uh, as always, let's have a word of Alistair first. Something on your mind? I have some questions. Of course. Hmm. If you're always raising a chantry, have you ever never never what? Had a good pair of shoes? Forget I asked. But how? This painful and cruel interrogation will haunt me, I tell you, haunt me forever. Or maybe just until lunch. Lunch makes everything better. Oh look, I have cheese. You're a strange individual, Alistair. But yeah, well, that was an interesting conversation, lamb line. I didn't realise that clear was gonna go in that direction. I suppose that was a bit naive of me. Hello, Zevron. Well we have yet to speak to you. Here I am. Here you are. Can I answer some questions? Oh, this should be good. Go ahead. Tell me a little about Antiva. Oh, you wish to know about Antiva, do you? The only way to truly appreciate it would be to go there. It is a warm place, not cold and harsh like this Ferelden. In Antiva it rains often, but the flowers are always in bloom. Or so the saying goes. Don't you want to go back? It's not really a matter of wanting to go back. I cannot go. At least not yet. I hail from the glorious Antiva city, home to the royal palace. It is a glittering gem amidst the sand, my Antiva city. Do you come from someplace comparable? I was born in Hyever, in the north. Oh, I have never seen that place. I am sure it has its charms and its dogs. <laughs> hmm. You know what is most odd? We speak of my homeland and for all its wine and its dark haired beauties and the lilo flutes of the minstrels, I miss the leather the most. Now that is odd. I mean the smell. For years I lived in a tiny apartment near Antiva City's leather making district. In a building where the crows stored their youngest recruits, packed in like crates. I grew accustomed to the stench, even though the humans complained of it constantly. To this day, the smell of fresh leather is what reminds me most of home more than anything else. You sound like you've been away for, from home forever. Oh, not so long, I know. It is my first time away from Antiva, however. And the thought of never returning makes me think of it constantly. Before I left, I was tempted to spend what little coin I possessed on leather boots I spotted in the store window. Finest Antivan leather. Perfect craftsmanship. Ah, but I was a fool to leave them. I thought, ah, Zevran, you can buy them when you return as a reward for a job well done. More the fool I, no? The job being killing me, right? Yes, and now here I am. One simply never knows what is to come next. How could I have suspected I would end up defeated by a handsome Grey Warden? A man who then spares my life? I could not. Yeah, everyone makes mistakes. Even Grey Wardens who spare the lives of assassins? <laughs> Understood. Now, if it is all the same to you, I would prefer not to speak more of Antiva. It makes me wistful and hungry for a proper meal. Yeah, fair enough. Well, let us speak to Wynn. Oh, it's been a long day. Rest, 
rest would be welcome. Are you all right? Yes, yes, of course. I am just a little weary. As you may have noticed, I'm no spring chicken. You are very sprightly for your age, though. Thank you. You're very kind to say so. But in all honesty, I do not know how many years I have left in me. I have lived for such a long time. But there is always something else to do. And I have to keep going in order to do it. I think I will be glad when I am done. I'm sure you'll be kicking around for years yet. Oh, I don't know. I really don't. <laughs> oh, she's such a pessimist, Win. But, oh well. Ah, Liliana, what do you have to say? Yes. I still have the option to think I think you should go. That's a bit awkward, really. I'd like to talk. Well, here I am. What would someone like you be doing in Love Room's Chantry? What is meant by someone like me? They don't exactly teach you how to fight in the cluster, do, do they? Did you think I was always a cloistered sister? The Chantry provides succour and safe harbour to all who seek it. I chose to stay and become affirmed. Affirmed? We affirm our belief in the Maker, in Andraste and the Chant, but other than that, there are no vows taken. What did you do before that? I was a travelling minstrel in Orlais. Tales and songs were my life. I performed, and they rewarded me with applause and coin. And my skill in battle? Well, you pick up different skills when you travel, yes? Yes, of course. Um, let's move on. Hmm. Yes, I'm sure. Hello, Stan. Do you have anything to say about the Grey Wardens yet? Yes. I have a question. I am hardly surprised. Why did you come to Ferelden? To answer a question. Uh, what was the question? The Arishok asked what is the blight. By his curiosity, I am now here. What's an Arishok? The one who commands the Antam, the body of the Kunari. Why does he care about the Blight? Why do you? Ferelden is my home. So if this Blight were in Orlais, it could consume the land with impunity. Don't strain yourself pondering that. I do not know why the Arishok sent us. He commands and I go. Did you find the answer to his question? A portion of it. What was the answer? Were you not at Ostagar when the army was overwhelmed? That is your answer. Don't you have to report back then? Yes. When are you going to do that? Never. I cannot go home. Why not? It doesn't matter now. Can we move on? We keep the dark spawn waiting. Let's go. As you wish. Hmm. Learn a little bit more about Sten. Does Morgan have anything to say about us saving the circle? Let's find out. What do you wish of me? Uh, I'd like to ask you something. If you must. Uh, never mind. <laughs> I think we've had those options already. Sandal, Bowden. What do you have for sale? If there's anything I can do for you, please, please, tell me. Have you heard any rumours? There's terrible news. Everyone is talking about a battle in the north between Logain's men and Ban Bronick. The Ban was utterly crushed. Someone told me that he was meeting with Logain to talk terms, but I don't believe it. Surely Logain would never attack someone attempting to parley. That's what I've heard on the road, anyhow. Take it for what it is. 
here. Where do these goods come from? Not the, not the deep roads. Look, we we don't rob people, all right? We don't take things from people that need them. The things in the law's tides, what good did they do lying there? I brought them back to Orzammar, where people could look at them and remember. It's not all that different up here. There are places long abandoned by the humans everywhere. Even more now with the Darkspawn coming. What do you mean? People flee from the blight with good reason, but they forget things. Things with value and meaning. They leave them behind because they're frightened and desperate. And sometimes, my boy and I, we find our way to these places before the Horde descends, and we save these things. I take them away so the Darkspawn don't get them. Is that so bad? They destroy everything they touch. I suppose it's better than having a dark spawn take it all. That's what I tell myself, too. Ah, these are dark times indeed. Dark times, my friend. Let me see your wares, Bowden. I'm sure you'll be pleased with the goods my boy and I have collected, and with your discount. Yes, Bowden's very opportunistic, I suppose is the word. But I'm not going to complain. He does me a good deal sometimes. Well, keep the daggers. Uh, I don't need that axe. Uh, what else don't we need? Actually, I could probably equip that um, thickened cap now since I've done up my strength a little. What else do we. What else could we use? I suppose I could equip those as well for the moment. What do these do? I don't need that. Oh, that. We may as well pass those, um, those two runes over to the Circular Magi. I don't mind giving them, it may give them slight bonuses, I don't know how this is going to work later on. Uh, yeah, okay. Uh, before we do anything else, let's look at our gifts and just see what we can actually give the people. Uh, tribal necklace, I imagine it's going to be for Morrigan, I'm guessing. A fine gift. You oh. have my thanks. Alistair might like those braces. Is that for me? Really? Wow. I'm... Yes, I'm sure you're happy. Let's give you some um, bones, Doug. You know you've already got 100% approval with me. Why the hell not? Chantry Amulet. Liliana? Maybe? I... That's a wonderful thought. I don't know what to say. You're very welcome. The Rose of Olé is a book about a woman lame named Lady Talia and her tempt <laughs> temptuous romance with the arrogant Chevalier Garen. Ah, uh, yeah, I suppose. Oh. How dear of you. Thank you so much. And the steel symbol of Andraste. Oh, how dear of you. Thank you so much. It's still neutral. Something happened there. Codex updated. Oh, okay. She gained a skill. Did she? Um, skills and talents. She's gained a minor bonus to cunning. Oh well, excellent. What else do we have here? I can get rid of 
The Black Grimrar. Uh, Morrigan, probably. I don't imagine Wynne will be appreciative of it. What? You found Flemeth's Grimoire? Ever since we discovered the condition of the Mage's Tower, I had wondered if it might be recoverable. But I had yet to speak of it to you. How fortunate that you found it on your own. You have my thanks. I will begin study of the tome immediately. What do, ho what do you hope to find within it? Secrets. My mother has many of them, and this tome represents the one time that they were able to get away from her. I do not intend to squander this opportunity to learn more than Flemeth wished me to know. This should be... interesting. Oh dear, what the hell did I just do? <laughs> I forgot that that was like a tome of black magic. Uh, with the name Black Grimoire, I should have actually thought on about that. But it did open up a quest for us. Um, okay. You found Flemeth's tone and gave it to Morrigan. She seems quite eager to start studying it, and Maker only knows what she'll learn from it. Yeah, Maker only knows. Oh dear God, what have I done? If this comes back to bite me in the ass, you can all tell me you told me so. Okay, what else do we have? Oh, what am I? Oh, I'm thinking of I can put that helmet on. I'm so glad I got helmets turned off. Let's see. A small gold bar. I don't know who wants that. Gold scythe. To vent down. It's a bottle of wine, I think. Um, does Liliana like wine? Why, thank you so much. Mm, guess so, but we might even bet you better for someone else. A small carving of a robed woman? Maybe? Why, thank you so much. Mm, not so much, okay. I might be messing these up. So be it. A small white flat uh, flat white stone with a gold rune carved into it. Maybe wind like stones? I don't know, I'm guessing. Oh marvellous. Well, no, she seemed to like it. Dwarven rune bracelet. Ah, uh, okay, we'll keep a hold of that. Small silver ring? There's a... Oh, uh, let's see what you say. Why, thank you so much. Oh, okay. And we won't give anyone the dirty pair of pantaloons, because that would probably be ridiculous. Alright. Not a very large block of cheese, it is, isn't it? Bloody hell. Well, if all else fails, we've got cheese. Turn in runes for the circle. Turn in unassigned novice runes. Even the Templars will be impressed by the powers you will command. Okay. So, yes, it's taken us almost 20 minutes, but we've managed to sort the camp out once more. I am wearing two long swords, and hopefully I have got my skills set up properly that I actually do decent damage with them. What is my... Oh, I've got 40 dexterity. Jesus Christ. Constitution's not too bad. Cunning's decent, and I don't think I need that much strength. But with it, I can wear some long swords. So let's continue. Indeed. Yes. Yes. Yeah, actually. Oh, yes. Indeed. There you go. Yes. I'll organize everyone properly. With completing the circle of magi. The blight has spread further. I'm sure of it now. Let us go to... Redcliffe Village, actually. Do we need to go to Redcliffe Village? Apologies, let us search our quest once more. Uh, Denerim, definitely. The Mage's Collective. You 
you've delivered all the condolences. Oh no, I guess we don't. Oh yes, I was, I was going to go to Red Cliff just to see what had changed, if yes. anything. Indeed, yes. So yeah, we can go to Air Red Cliff Village first. It's the nearest place. And then we will go to Denerim and, and see if anything's changed before we continue our journey. I think after this we'll be going to Haven. Oh. Meanwhile, in Denerim itself. Sire, I have more news. Um, yes. Well, it seems that the fighting has gone Enough. exactly as you... I would like to know what you intend to accomplish, Father. Should we not be fighting the Darkspawn instead of each other? The nobility should be brought into line and then the Darkspawn defeated. This is no true blight, Honora. Only Kalen's vanity demanded it be so. Beg pardon, sir. But blight or no, we may not have the manpower to face the Darkspawn soon. Kalen approached your legions for support, did he not? Never! Marek and I drove those bastards out! Not roll out the welcome for them now. We need help, Father. We cannot deal with this crisis alone. Ferelden will stand on its own. I will lead it through this, Anora. You must have faith in me. Did you kill Kalen? Kalen's death was his own doing. Oh boy, I guess Anora's found out that, um, yeah. Her father didn't exactly help her husband. So let us travel to the Chantry and see what's changed, if anything. If we have any new quests for completing one of the primary goals. No, there are no quests available at this time, but we can turn the water blackstone quests in. Your efforts are greatly appreciated. Not a problem. Ah, we'll check the blackstone chest actually while we're here. No, still no quests available. That's fine. I think can we just leave this way? Yes, we can. Okay, let us go to Denerim and see if we can actually enter the alienage. I'm surprised we didn't encounter Darkspawn there. But I suppose there's time yet. No, we are here in Denerim once more. Can I cancel quests while I'm in here? Okay. I'm sure that the Friends of R Red Jenny wasn't a good quest I forced to have. All men are the work of our maker's hand. From the lowest slave to the highest slave. Those who bring ham without provocation. It was just a quest here, wasn't it? I suppose I could always say ignorance is bliss since I got the quest in my log anyway. Good to see you again. Good to see you again. Yeah, it was that one, wasn't it? Blood was a blood warning. Apparently not. Oh, friends of Red Jenny. Okay, let's go down there and have a word, I suppose. Let's see what this is all about.
Huh? Strange. Oh, mysterious door. I didn't actually see it. I didn't realize I could go through this door. Oh, the door opens a crack in response to your knock. There is a light breeze and a change in pressure. The door closes. Hmm, I don't feel too good about that quest, but... If it comes back to bite us in the butt, well, we'll shall find out and deal with it then. Can we enter the alienage yet? Yeah, damn Grey Warden poster. The alienage is closed. Be on. The alienage is closed. Be on your way. I guess not. Oh well. So we still can't do some of these quests in Denerim or for the Blackstone Irregulars. So, with that in mind... My brother and his family made it out of Lothering. He said that the Darkspawn attacked it the very next day. The Darkspawn took Lothering, did they? I don't know. I expect so, since there was no one there to stop them. Well, it won't be much longer until those monsters get here. There doesn't seem to be anyone fighting them now. Oh, boy. Has uh, any of the merchants actually got a restock on their inventory yet? Let's find out. Hello, bartender. What can I get you, stranger? Let me see what you have. Right, I'll show you around. Mm, you see, you have some more health poultices. I'll take both of them. Uh, no, you don't have any more elf fruit. Kind of a shame, but. So if we cannot, um, well, we can't do any more quests here in Denrim, yeah, as I say, I guess we are going to Haven, where Brother Javenti was searching for more clues for the Urn of Sacred Ashes now. Yeah, I don't see why not. Let's see if we can find the Urn so we can cure all Aemon. Ah, yeah, it was on the way back. Dogspawn? No? <gasps> Beja Jome. That name sounds familiar. We have a quest from that. Several of the circle enchanters were unknowingly studying the same forged tome. I see. Fake merchant. He has a lot of friends. This could go fun. Ah, a fellow traveller of the Fair Lands. Are you a seeker, perchance? My packs are light, but I have a tome of strange origin. The Deus V Eternus, rumoured to be the last message to a sinful world from the Maker himself. That's so strange. I have five copies. Ah, will the wonders of this all too small a land never cease? Well... They will for you. Get them! <laughs> <laughs> Battle cries. We all love them. Dog, go get the mage, please. Shall we go? Oh, I totally realized I need to replay with all my skills. Oh dear. Okay. That's what I was trying to go. Two minutes. I'm not ready to fight you. Cameo Cowl. Plus two cunning. 
For a mage? Really? Seems even in death you can't be useful. Is that a bit negative of me? Oh well. Continue forwards. So, yeah, the quest is complete now. Area locked, the village of Haven. So, when we come back, we will explore this village and see. Brother Javenti is still here and find out if he has any knowledge of the Urn of Secret Ashes. So, this has been Anfulf and I hope you've all enjoyed and I hope you all take care and I'll see you all next time. Bye bye now.